When I was a boy, I liked fish. As long as they were fried in batter with a serving of fries. But raw! Ugh. Mr. Hubert, how can you eat that stuff? <sighs> ah, Billy. A raw monkfish plucked straight from the nets of a Norwegian trawler. Oh, what could be more succulent, more delicate, more desirable? A hamburger? Hmm. I can't say I have ever partaken of that particular culinary delight. Hmm. The Jolly Mouser. Well, I bet they eat burgers on board ship. Those sailors are probably scoffing some down no, even as they speak. Oh. Hey! What did you do that for? Don't go near the ships. The rats on the docks lack any sense of decency and decorum. They are particularly hard on city cats. And lately, cats have been spirited away from these parts, never to be seen again. Spirited away? Aha! What have we here? A feast of fishy fins fit for the feline fancy. Oh, haven't you eaten enough already, Mr. Hubert? Mr. Hubert? Mr. Hubert? Come on, Billy. Give your old friend a helping paw. Hurry up then, Mr. Hubert, before someone catches us. <laughs> Hardly probable, my boy. We'll be well away before anyone is the wiser. <gasps> hey, you flea-infested feline. What are you doing? Oh, no. I can do without that. Huh? Billy! Help! It looked like Mr. Hebert's plan was about to come crashing down. On me! Billy? Billy? Billy! Where are you, lad? Oh, this is no time for a game of hide-and-seek! You stupid cat! Look at the mess you've made! I'll give you a good kicking for that! Come here! I'm soaked! Clumsy oaf! Hmm. I'd better find Billy before that uncouth lout pulls himself out of the water. Billy! Billy! <coughs> Mr. Hubert? Mr. Hubert! Something smelled fishy, and it wasn't just me. Mr. Hubert had gone, but right now all I cared about was washing the taste of haddock out of my mouth. It was then that some kind human came to my rescue. Oh, did the little putty cat have a big fall? Don't worry, I have something to make you feel better. You'll enjoy this. It's a knockout. <laughs> I'm a boy, and I hate milk. But I love milkshakes. Though, this one had a strange bitter taste. I wanted strawberry. Not... the last time I spent a night on the town with Mr. Hubert. Ha! Waking up, are we? Well, after you've shaken off that sleeping potion, we'll put you to work on the rats. Rats? Did he say rats? I don't think so. Stop him! He's trying to escape! Uh-oh. I think I'm in trouble. As a cat, I was still wet behind the ears. And I was about to end up wet everywhere else, too. Ah! 
Nothing like turmoil and anxiety to stimulate the appetite. But how can I think of food when my little companion is missing? <laughs> On the other hand, I must fortify myself for a prolonged search. No! No! Fortitude, Hubert! Are you a cat or a mouse? Billy is definitely not to be found in the docks. Which means... No. Perhaps his ship has sailed. Oh dear, oh my. If Billy has somehow managed to get himself aboard that ship, I will have lost my best friend and companion forever. Uh, uh, hi guys. I hope you don't mind me dropping in like this. We don't like trespasses on our ship. Rats come in all shapes and sizes. And this one looked like one mean dude. They call me King, and what I say goes around here. And the first thing that's going is you! Get him, guys! I end up on a ship full of vermin with a bad attitude. Bring him down, boys! <laughs> him.
Yes, 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 I need your assistance to save our friend Billy. What? Uh, who are you? What are you doing here? Hmm, not very polite, is he? No, we haven't even been introduced. Introduced? I'm Billy. I know I look like a cat, but I'm really a boy. Obviously suffering from delusions. I'm not sure. He has the manners of a boy. Still, he could be useful. Hello, I'm Tiger Lily. I'm Lodmila. We've been catnapped. Oh, we're being smuggled out of the country to be sold to desperate, catless couples. It's just torture being away from home. This no smoked salmon. No caviar. Caviar? What's that? Caviar is made from the finest fish eggs. All cats from the best homes eat it. Ugh. Ugh. Sounds revolting. But don't worry. I'll soon get you out of there. Gotcha, you flea bitten rat bag. Ugh. I told you to catch rats. Not wreck me ship. Hey, how do cats do that thing with their claws? <sighs> how did that happen? I quit. <laughs> no! Story. You just try to throw me off the trail. Well, everything seems to be in order this time, Crunch. But we'll be looking out for you. Not if I see you first. Now get off me, ship! Okay, Poodle Breath. If you won't listen to reason, it's time to take the tiger by the tail. In this case, dog. 
and his crew, and the cats were saved. Unfortunately, they wanted to show their gratitude. Oh, oh Billy! Billy you're you're all right. Right. Oh, oh, boy. Boy. Thank you, Billy. You saved my life. Jumbo! Help! Billy, it's good to have you back. Be back, Mr. Hubert. 
Well, Billy, perhaps you might care to introduce me to your friend? There are no friends of mine, Mr. Hubert. I'm a boy. Remember? A boy. I am not interested in female cats. Ah, such a strong delusion, and in one so young. I had a friend once who was convinced he was a porcupine. Had a special way of rolling in the mud and licking his fur into sharp points. <laughs> My uncle thought he was a fish. Drowned, poor cat.